All right, this is uh, my friend Tom and Dive Buddy Tom's uh, video of uh, uh, me going down, uh, not to 17.3, um, but to uh, like 13 meters on this one. Uh, it was actually the dive before this where I hit 17.2. Uh, I accidentally told him it was 17.3, but I looked at the dive watch today and it was 17.2 meters down. Um, my deepest so far, um, haven't found, I haven't been able to dive a deeper place. So, I mean, I hit the bottom and came back with the dirt from the bottom. Um, anyway, uh, the reason why I don't have this captured on video going down, up and down, um, is because, uh, my, uh, camera's, uh, micro SD card ran out of space and I, of course, did not have a backup anyway, um, uh, what can I say? Um, there it goes. Albert, uh, that, that's, depth um, dive two, aiming for 17.2 meters. Mike, Mike spotting. spotting. And I'm down there right now. Uh, he's watching me until I disappear. Yep. Time at 23, 25 seconds. 29 seconds, 30. Anyway, I'm gonna skip through here. There he is, one minute and 11 seconds. Wow. And dirt, you got the dirt? I couldn't equalize, so I was like. So, um, at the very end of that video, I was just explaining. Uh, that I couldn't equalize and uh, it was taking forever to get down so I, I actually saw the bottom at about 13 something meters and uh, I just decided to turn around rather than risk a blackout. Um, anyway it went over a minute 10 I think and uh, uh, yeah the whole way down I was like having to turn my body right side up to equalize and then turn back down and continue going down and I did that at least five times um, anyway that's what it was okay so it's a week after we went on our Awaji dive uh, this is my oceanic uh, F10 is it uh, dive watch uh, Sunday past midnight, I should be going to sleep soon because I have to wake up at about 5.50 in the morning. Um, anyway, just wanted to show you something real quick. Okay, this is um, last week's dive. Today we did 43, well, I, I did 43 dives um, according to the watch. <clears throat> This doesn't record really shallow dives, though, but we, we did a lot of dives that day. Most of them were not that deep, um, and a lot of it was looking for an anchor. Anyway, um, that's 9-15, uh, September 15, 2019. Uh, that was the temperature of the water on that day. At, uh, what, what, that, that's 4, 4 p.m., I guess. Wow pretty late um, anyway uh, let me go back uh, let's see it should go to 42 yeah there we are so I'm just gonna backtrack to the uh, deepest dive I did that day well deepest dive I did in my life actually okay so this was the uh, second attempt uh, at uh, getting to 17 meters um, but I, I just couldn't equalize and it was taking forever and I didn't want to black out on the way up so I stopped at 13.8 and turned back up and then one before this 28th dive what 8.9 now I must have really failed on that one 9.1 ah there we go okay dive number 26 was 17.2. Oh, now I remember. The other two dives were, um, I was spotting uh, Mike on his deep dive, making sure he wasn't gonna black out or making sure 
uh, I was there to rescue if I had to. Anyway, uh, that was the dive. I kept saying it was 17.3, but um, it was actually 17.2 meters. Um, the dive time down was uh, 55 seconds. Um, it didn't feel especially long, but but uh, but it was a little bit scary because it's dark down there and um, uh, just worried about you know blacking out on the way up. Anyway, uh, let me also show you this. Okay, this is my view. <clears throat> okay, this is showing the ever <clears throat> part. Um, so it's like uh, best ever. Um, 17.2, which I just showed you, and 55 seconds down during that dive. And the uh, longest time down was at 4.6 meters, and it was... Um, uh, two minutes and 47 seconds. So uh, I'm going to try to beat three minutes soon if I can. All right. And I want to beat 17.2. Uh, 30 is my goal. Um, well, maybe deeper if possible. Thank you.